You guys know you can get me at lastrosebud.com. You know that. You know you can hit me on my email, lastrosebud at gmail.com for these questions. Now, I'm finna, um, I'm starting something different. I'm gonna have another set of videos that I do. It's gonna be down and dirty videos. About this pimp game, I get too much, too many people emailing, and I ain't been answering them because I just don't like to uh, focus on that because you guys don't be serious enough. So what I want you to understand is the only way I'm gonna keep doing these, you know, once I try it. Is if I get the right feedback from you, you guys, man. You guys don't ask no questions. You know, you, you don't do anything except, I guess, listen, which shows that you really don't have what it takes, you know, be out in the damn street. But I'm gonna try this last little video. This not this last. This I'm gonna just try this one. You know, and I'm sure you motherfuckers all know who I am and you know what I'm about. So I ain't gonna go into none of that bullshit. You guys should know that you know I'm gonna represent to you the who, what, when, where, and why. Those are the five W's. Who, what, when, where, and why. That you know of, of turning out. Why the fuck do you want to turn out? Why do you do you know why <laughs> you want to turn out? And before y'all start all this hello bullshit, you know, fuck all that. Listen, listen to this shit because I don't want that shit. I'll block that shit off. I don't, I don't want that. I can't stress enough how important it is for you to be serious about this. Let me ask you a question. And, and, and this is what I want you to do. As I ask the questions. I want you to fucking answer them in the goddamn, uh, whatever this goddamn chat room shit is. Don't speak to me. I don't want to say hello. Answer these motherfucking questions that I'm going to ask as I go on. Can you do that? Because that would be a pretty good goddamn conversation to me. And the first question that I want to, you know, since now, 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 let me get this straight too. These videos are different than the other video. That's why I'm going to count these as down and dirty videos. These ain't the regular videos. So when you see me getting ready to do a down and dirty video, it's about this game. Now, this is the first question. And if you motherfuckers put up high and all that goddamn bullshit, I'm, I'm going to go off there. I ain't doing it. Because what I'm saying is I don't want to speak to your motherfucking ass. I want to speak to you about this game. I don't want to. I, I said I don't want to speak to you twice. No, I meant to say I don't want to say hello to your motherfucking ass. I want to speak to you about this game. <laughs> so do you fucking know why you listening to me? That's the first question. Answer that shit, motherfuckers. Yeah, so you don't want to answer no real shit. You don't fucking know why you listen to me and you know it. Because cause what? I, I make you smile? Is that why you listen? Because I make your motherfucking ass smile? Well, what make you 
want to hear what the fuck I got to say about this game. What makes you want to hear it? If you don't know why you're listening to me, well, let's say you do know why you're listening to me. What make you want to hear this motherfucking shit? Why? Because you want to be in the game? Most of you motherfuckers listening to me aren't serious enough uh, to want to hear what the fuck I have to say. Because this lifestyle is difficult. It's difficult enough for motherfuckers like me. And I suggest if you want to learn some of this game, you should get real with yourself before going on with me. Because what you don't understand is simply because you cannot address what I be talking about shows that you're not prepared for this fucking game. You guys are playing. Let's see what you're saying right here. I see a few motherfuckers just saying some shit. Let's see what you're saying. Okay. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> okay, you motherfuckers. You might need, you might get this shit. I got a lot of answers. Let's see. Well, Star Mike, you might have said top of it before I said what the fuck I said about this shit. So I ain't gonna say nothing. You matter of fact, it was three of y'all that was up there. So I ain't reading y'all shit. Let's look. What is that new doc? When is that new documentary coming out? Man, it ain't mine. And I don't think I said one thing about the documentary. So who is this? Chester Charm. Don't come up with shit that I ain't talking about. All right? Uh, no, no, Chester Charm, that wasn't you. I'm sorry, man. That was Roll Tide. Roll Tide. Don't, don't do that, all right? Uh, okay, Chester Charm answering the question because you make life easier. No, I don't. No, uh-uh. I ain't making life easier. If anything, I'm making life more difficult. Now, it may be easier for you because you might be one one of the motherfuckers that wanted to go because I make it clearer to understand how to maneuver, but I ain't making it easy. And if I am, shoot me. Uh, <laughs> okay, question one, Q1 answer. I'm listening to you because I want to be a better version of myself and I want to be a master at catching females. Now, you leave Carl 360, your motherfucking ass be saying some, that was okay answer as far as that go. But goddamn it, you be saying some crazy ass fucked up shit. Now, that wasn't. So don't, don't get into that. I got a lot to say. So don't turn me off with your bullshit. If you really want to be a better version of yourself, then you're doing the right thing. Uh, Roll Tide, that collab with Mr. Lucario. What about it? Oh, that document. Lucario got that shit. I'm listening to take over conversations and affect my um, environment. Uh, okay, I, I know you meant Lucario, man. Tevin Grinishu, because you be a pimp. You got because to be a pimp, you got to be a man first. I, I agree with that too. You are wise, my brother. That's why. Okay, you motherfuckers. I want to become a real man. Yeah, bro. I just got here. Okay, roll tag. Heard you was in that new big documentary coming out. That's all. That's why I'm even here on your channel to check you out, brother. Okay, roll tag. Now we don't need all that. Now let let let, let me you know get y'all to understand <laughs> you. You motherfucker surprised me right there. <laughs> but that just so you can follow instructions. So we might have a good conversation today. Let me continue with what the fuck I'm talking about. Because this shit is real, what I'm talking about. And it, and it, as you see, I'm getting my notes prepared so that I won't tell you no motherfucking bullshit. When I get willing to do something, I'll write the shit down. Because I sit here at my desk and I 
think about whatever the fuck I'm thinking about. And then I start writing whatever I'm thinking about it. Then I put it down as my little bullet points so that as I kick it with you, I don't get lost. I'm serious, man. I'll be serious. And like I said, most of you motherfuckers aren't serious enough, but at least you ask them the right questions. So, what I'm really saying is this shit is going to be really difficult for you if you know you're not in if you you're not really secure if you're not uh confident i mean it, you can say what you want to say you can believe what you want to believe but you know motherfuckers like me i'm from cali york i don't know this bitch i don't even know these motherfuckers here can you do that if you can't, you, I ain't saying you can't. I'm just saying when I go there, I'm getting at the bitch too. And I'm catching some. This is wherever I'm going, because I ain't tripping on where I'm at. I'm tripping on it all. Now, you motherfuckers are gonna be tripping on all the other extracurricular bullshit to make you think about shit to keep you from doing shit. So as I go on and kick this shit. I want you fucking with me in the chat room addressing what the fuck I'm Now, none of you motherfuckers mentioned pimping, so maybe you don't want to be pimps. That's cool. A couple of you motherfuckers mentioned being a, a better man. Now, that's where I'm really at. So, I get a lot of pimp motherfuckers, so it's going to be some on here. So, I'm going to say the word pimp. A lot. But let me tell you, motherfucker, something. Something that you probably would never believe. And I'm serious. You can go to any video I've made since I've been making them, and you can listen to it. And every time you hear the word pimp, you can substitute man. And what I'm saying is. <laughs> The reason you can do that is because when I'm kicking this pimp, I'm only talking about being an alpha man. You know, and if you can separate that shit coming from a pimp nigga, because most of you motherfuckers can't. Because I know motherfuckers ain't had a hoe in their life and they men. And they act just like me. We hang out, we roll together. Bernard shit, that nigga ain't had no bitch. I mean, he had bitches, but he ain't no pimp nigga. I fuck with that nigga every time I go to L.A. Before, I fuck with pimps. Why? Because that nigga, man, that nigga do what he supposed to do. So what I'm saying to you square-ass motherfuckers, when you hear the word pimp, instead of cringing, <laughs> just say, oh, he come out of man. Because listen, listen to this. Just, just listen. And you will understand because if you want to be a pimp, you got to motherfucking be able to approach women, women you don't know, and you have to be able to paint a picture with words that this bitch can see. Now, you heard what I just said. If you want to be a pimp, you got to be able to go up to bitches and paint a picture with words that she can see. Now, tell me, you can't say. If you want to be a man, you got to be able to approach bitches that you don't know and paint a picture with words that she can see. I'm telling you, you trip on the pimp and not me. If you know how to listen, because that's what attracted me to Bernard. You know, woo, 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 we was kidding, woo, woo, woo. And I said, nigga, you ain't no motherfucking pimp. You know, this is when we first met. Then he's acting like he doesn't understand what I was saying. He said, nigga, I ain't no pimp, but I'm a man, man. You know, all I got to do is understand that you talking some man shit. Man, man, nigga, <laughs> have a drink. Because <laughs> that's what's up. My thing 
is that I have to separate shit with you motherfuckers because you always want to categorize whatever the fuck a nigga talking about. What if the nigga just talking about life? See, so get your shit together while you listen to me because I'm tired of talking to y'all. Uh, uh, excuse me, talking about y'all don't have no questions or comments on, on the fucking topic that we kick it. So uh, I'm going to take for granted you got that. My answers, my comments is going to be far over your motherfucking head if you can't apply them to yourself. You have to be able to apply what's being said to yourself. Therefore, don't turn off when you hear the word pimp. You can understand that's just me kicking pimp shit. But I'm really talking to a motherfucker that want to be a man. I just didn't say man. So I need to know you understand what I'm saying, which means you have to ask questions and make comments to let me know. And every once in a while, I start I look at their motherfuckers. Because I want to know motherfuckers understand me. I do not want to just talk. I don't talk to talk. Anybody can sit and listen to me kick it. But it's going to take more than just sitting and listening to me to understand what the fuck I'm talking about. So let me ask you a couple of questions. Are you in the least bit unsure of yourself? In any situation, fucking with a bitch, going for a job, uh, any situation, let me hear what you got to say about that. Because I know at times, well, I better not say this until I give you a minute or two because I know all you motherfuckers are starting lying. If you hear what I got to say about it, you motherfuckers ain't real dudes. You ain't real men because I can't say some shit like that and you race to answer it. <laughs> That's what real motherfuckers do, man. They race to answer shit. They ain't, nigga, it don't take me no motherfucking three seconds to think. Shit, in three seconds, the world could end. Who should I take it back? I got four, five motherfuckers. Let's see what y'all said. Uh oh. Uh oh, Ooh, some old motherfuckers coming up. Let me move this shit out the way. Okay. Unbelievable too. Words unlock more doors than any key. Okay. I don't know what the fuck you come out there. All these square. Wait a minute, you guys. Wait a minute. What the fuck? Oh, there it is. All these square ass comments, bud. Kicks the pimp shit. Hey, hey, check this out, bro. Why don't you get off? Matter of fact, I'm going to block you. Fuck you. You punk motherfucker. I kick what I want to. You're blocked. Fuck you in your comment. How you like that? OEMP or whatever your fucking name was. Uh, answer to question two. I'm definitely unsure because I know my conversation ain't going nowhere most of the time. Ramon Bales. Check game, Ramon. You could take the shortcut and go to my site. I got conversation tools, 66 of them. And you can see how to talk. You can see what you use. You use your environment to talk, bro. I'll give you that. That's free. I don't, I, I'll never have to be at a loss of words. Period. <laughs> Period. Well, I'm saying the business be right outside on my motherfucking side walk, walking back. I'm going to have something to say, girl, let me give you a ride, get you out of this area. You look way too fine to be walking out here. I don't know. I'm just saying I'm going to say something, bro. Shit. Uh, where was I at? Oh, question two. Yeah, man. In the, in the, that was a shortcut. The best way is to get your ass in SWU so I can show you you because you don't know you. You don't know how to talk about your motherfucking self. You don't know how to do anything that but pretend to be a motherfucker that you ain't. But I can tell from your question or your statement that you ain't really into that pretending shit. You want to be real. Okay, man, be real or not. 
that's up to you. But if you want to be real, fuck with me. Fuck with me on the SWU tip. Yeah, it's going to cost some money, but you're going to be just like every other motherfucker, man. So glad you did it. That you come back for semesters just to get more gang. Because you know what? After you pay, you know, you go through it, you learn the shit, you graduate, whatever. You can come back next semester, next semester after that, free. Why? Because I know game is ongoing. And only the motherfucker that know that is going to want to come back. And don't you know everyone, not everyone, a lot of them motherfuckers come back. Because they know I kick real shit. Them niggas see leaps and bounds growth in their ass about being confident, about sure or what to say to a motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Because I teach that shit. How do you, how do you think uh, the, you motherfucker that I blocked uh, uh, that you might still can listen? I don't know if I'm blocking. I don't know if I kick you out. But well, I'm saying, how do you think a nigga like me from Cali can go to goddamn uh, uh, New Mexico on University Avenue there and catch motherfucking bitches that I don't know. I ain't from New Mexico. I go to New York. I go to Minnesota. I go to Florida. I go to China. I'm going to catch a motherfucking bitch. Why? Because I know what to say and I know what to look for in a bitch's eyes when she listening to me. I know how to look at her facial expression and if her nose flare or not. Man, I know how to see if she pursed her lips while I'm talking. Because all this shit means something. I teach that shit, man. You know, I, I know how to read what she leaned and she leaning forward like that. Or if she leaning backwards like this. Or if she got her shoulders like that. Oh, come on, man. I know how to catch. You motherfuckers know how to be entertained. Now, uh, what was I doing? Oh. Where's the website so you can see? <laughs> see, people, this is this, this is what I don't understand about motherfuckers. I already said that my my website and my email, but I said again, askrosebud at gmail.com for the email. Askrosebud.com is the website. Now, what I'm saying, fellas. Why I'm talking all this goddamn shit is that these questions don't I got like 20 of them, but I only asked you three or four so far. But these questions are the questions that you need to answer. Because until you do, you will never catch. You will never catch. You got too much doubt in your mind. You don't know shit about you. <laughs> the first month, matter of fact, this month of April, because uh, this semester is new, that's all we talking about. Tell me something about yourself so I can show you where you're lying. Show you where you ain't doing nothing but telling yourself a, a fairy tale version of what you really know. Motherfucker, come on. And everybody sit up in there trying to tell me whatever the fuck. And I think, man, look, bro. I ain't got to see you or hear you or, or, or talk to you on the phone to, to know where the fuck you coming from or what kind of person you are. Then I roast them. And I roast them until they admit it. And when they admit it, them motherfuckers, they don't say these words, but this is what they say. Oh, man. I just lift a thousand pounds off my shoulders. And then them mother, but it takes a month. It fucking takes a month. A month of going through changes with dudes trying to tell me some shit. I only told them to go out, go out and say hi. And then they won't tell me why they can't do it and all. But, <laughs> but <laughs> it's funny. And even the motherfuckers in group. After they realize it, they be chuckling about it when they talk about it. Because they realize how pumped they was being. But you can't realize you being punk if you fucking with a bunch of punks. That's why I take motherfuckers coming to goddamn SWU 
and see a whole bunch of motherfuckers that used to be punks and ain't punks punking you off because they see you just like they was because I don't do all the punking. <laughs> the, the people in the group, when we have conference calls, you can't say weak shit. You can't. If I don't get you, some motherfucker in the group gonna get you. You know what you say that shit for? See, and, and, and what they, what do you hear me? What you say that for? Because if you don't know what you said, it for you damn so shouldn't have said. It. My folks think like that, man. My folks sharp in a motherfucker. Now, I ain't gonna fuck with that right now. That I see you motherfuckers really goddamn ass to some. Serious, unbelievable truths. I'm gonna goddamn fucking uh, read this. You done wrote this long. I hate these long letters, man. Any motherfuckers, but I'd be unsure, but I had a decent reaction. <laughs> That's the thing on the, on the chair <laughs> on the corner. I was rolling the joint when I was on the side. After a few minutes, I said, Excuse me, miss, when she came close to me. Uh, you must be shy because I've been standing here for five minutes and you haven't said hi. So I introduced myself and we vibes from there. This don't happen enough though for me. Unbelievable truths. I don't know you at all. But I'm going to tell you what you just told me about yourself talking about this shit. You just told me which, which I'm going to say I think you was telling the truth in what you're saying. Uh, and, and then I'm gonna tell you why it don't ha happen enough for you. What I'm saying is, you 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 told the truth about being unsure, and in what you unsure about, you you really emphasize when you say you had a decent reaction to some convers conversation you put down, which meant she only spoke. You don't gotta tell me no. She just spoke. When you spoke, or she smiled, and, and what I'm saying, you was rolling the joint, woo -woo, and I guess you was rolling the joint, hoping the bitch seen you and had enough nerve to walk up to you and say hi. And and and, and so, but after you roll your joint, and you motherfucking like, damn, baby didn't say nothing. You made sure she seen that joint, and then you 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 told her you must be shy, girl, whatever. Now, what I'm saying is all that's fine. It ain't what I did. It ain't what no motherfucking SW you would do. But I'm saying this it's fine because you got a plan. I give you credit. You rolling the joint. You're trying to sit in sweet old baby. I guess you got a plan. Sound like it. But when she came closer to you, which, oh, man, she's coming close. Oh, shit. Tell me unbelievable truth that you tell the truth. I know this is how you felt, but let me tell you the kicker. See, when you told her you've been there for five minutes or whatever, and the bitch ain't came over and said hi and then, so you you gonna introduce yourself to her. I'm saying you told her that you were scary nigga. You've been looking at her for five minutes. You let the bitch make a move rather than you make a move. And then check this out. I guess you feel because y'all sat there and you didn't talk. I know you didn't. You just stood by. Her. I guess you think you was vibing. But you know the kicker to this unbelievable truth? The reason it don't happen enough is because that was probably the first time you did that. And I don't know when. Not tell the truth. Get your ass on there and tell the truth right now. How wrong was I? Come on, man. You're going to make these motherfuckers not get nothing else. Because I want to hear your motherfucking response to that. All right, nigga. Hey, unbelievable truth is handling y'all show today. See what I'm saying about scary motherfuckers? How can a motherfucker talk to a bitch and he can't even talk to me? 
<laughs> and I'm on the computer. <laughs> what, what I'm saying is motherfuckers like that be actually going out fucking with bitches. Well, they be going out to fuck with a bitch, but they, you know, really don't. But what I'm saying, when they do, they do the shit like this, but oh, here you go. I can get numbers. I actually smoked with Shawty. I was not trying to brag. We kissed. <laughs> oh, <laughs> my bad, brother. Let me tell you something. Oh, shit. My bad, bro. You you say you didn't just show it a joint, which you, you picked that up. I, I said you just showed it a joint. I, I would have said you should have smoked it with her, but you said you did. That was cool. But, but, but listen to this, listen to this, man. Don't start. You said some sharp shit. Now don't come following up with that weak bullshit there. But 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 wait a minute, man. Wait a minute. What I'm saying is you can get a number. But you know when you call them motherfuckers, they gonna be real. Oh, that's right. You don't even call them. <laughs> you get numbers and don't call them. Come, look, wait, bro. Let me tell you something else. You smoke that with the bitch, and you don't be trying to brag. Oh, you ain't trying to brag, but you kissed her. <laughs> <laughs> that's a little. You think of yourself, motherfucker. <laughs> what you do going around kissing bitches, man? <laughs> you going around kissing bitches to see if, if you guys are vibing? You stuck a, you stuck your tongue down that bitch though? I doubt it. Uh so what I'm saying is <laughs> you didn't really kiss a bitch. <laughs> a little peck on the cheek or whatever, man. Come on, man. Be real. Your conversation does not represent you doing that goddamn shit. You would have some other type of statements to make, bro. Come on, man. I can see some muddy water and spot dry land. Man. Come on, bro. Like, I already know who you are, man. You're going you gonna to listen to me talk, and, and then you're going to make up some shit to say going along with what the fuck I'm saying. Come on, man. That ain't how, how you do shit. It's cool. You did a lot of cool shit, man. It's just some shit you did was fucked up. And you can't take it? Or you can't take it? I don't know. <laughs> you, uh, uh, <laughs> let me read. Look like y'all said. <laughs> look like y'all said some slick shit. Let me, let me uh, see what the fuck you guys are talking about. Uh... Wait a minute, god damn. Oh shit. Damn, these niggas is tough as shit. Ah okay, I, I'm gonna start here. Chester Charm. Oh wait, no, I, I already had that. Okay, yeah. Yeah, bro, I just got it now. Okay, I'm a roll tie. Heard you was in that. No, I already seen that too. That's why I'm even here on your channel. Okay. Whatever. Macaroni. Something in me woke up. Now I'm straight, self-promoting, non-stop. Thanks, man. <laughs> yeah, that's what's up, man. Because steel, sharp and steel. I mean, throw me a state and watch me chew young life. <laughs> yeah, come on, man. Need this shit from a mentor. All right, Star Mike. Roll tight. This guy sounds funny. Roll tight. I like him. Whatever. Urban Mac, you're a cool player. Me. You're a cool player. Meet with history. That's still relevant. I guess that's what he had meant to say. Ramon Bells, answer the question one. You got the game I need. Bentley Coop, what's a good pimp? <laughs> what kind of words do you use, pimping? <laughs> Real pimps, I got love for that. Respect the rules of the game. Hey, hey, before I... Uh, okay, you guys... Now you ain't really asking shit, but I don't answer questions like that, you know, because I ain't trying to convince now one of you motherfuckers to be a pimp. I'm only telling you what motherfuckers think, how to think, and if you want to do it, take your ass off me and thank you. Don't ask me how to do it. I ain't hardly going to tell your ass how to go out and get killed. 
you know, because that's what's going to happen to you, motherfuckers, because you got punk in you. And motherfucker going to smell it. And they ain't having no punks around. It's not today. You might get away. When I, when I was rolling, you know, nigga, you ain't, you ain't qualified to be out here. And if you be out here tomorrow night, we finna attack your bitch. Nigga, and we gonna take her. And, and somebody gonna call you. Because punk motherfuckers can't handle no bitch out there. You ain't gonna do nothing but fuck the goddamn track up. Now, take the bitch and go do that call service or that out call shit or whatever the fuck. Don't come out here fucking the track up. Oh, that's how we used to kick it to motherfuckers. Punk ass niggas. Man, you think we playing now, nah, nigga? You know, you 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 can shoot a gun just like the next motherfucker. So what, what we gonna do is knock you off of that bitch. <laughs> and that. So you know, if you wanna just be out here bitchless, you know, we just gonna say yeah, he thought he had a nigga served him up proper, and you know, the nigga ain't got no bitch. He's just riding around now. Yeah, some um, some niggas was like that. They turn into bums, be on the corner. You know, have uh, cups. You know, put quad in for the nigga. They be so fucked up, they got knocked off of the bitch. <laughs> <laughs> so, how you become a, whatever, whoever asked you that, how you become a good pen is to go pen. That's how you become a good pen. And what kind of words you use in the pimping? Go out, get a halt, and start talking. Those are the words. Now, what you say, how you put them together, come on. I mean, damn, you act like a motherfucking pimp. Go say some words that a bitch ain't never heard before. I always say, go see that cat. Is that cat black? Do you feel a black cat is unlucky? I say plain words, mine. I make sure that bitch know what I'm talking about. Because when she says she coming with me, she going home. <laughs> she ain't talking about she going for no motherfucking ride with me. Didn't know I was talking about a hauling. Didn't know I was telling her what I'm telling her. Like, you motherfuckers be hitting around. Them. You know, baby, you know. Bitch, please. If you ain't going home, get out. It's that simple. Get your ass out if you ain't going home. Then the bitch gonna get out if she ain't going home. I ain't mad at your motherfucking ass. Hurry up, get out. Let me pull on off. Shit. Uh, <laughs> oh, what kind of work? Wait, sorry. Real pimps. Like, I love the respect for the game. Yeah, whatever. Nigga ain't got no respect for the game. And that is the skills of a painter with words. I don't know what you're talking about. DK Wholesale. <laughs> nigga, please. <laughs> you got the word wholesale in your name. Okay. Those I hate that. What's the advice on fear of rejection from approaching <laughs> in the first place? <laughs> Motherfucker. Rejection? Your dick should get hard when a motherfucking bitch reject you. Shit. Because pre she's just another one out the way. Because what I'm saying is the way I think about it. I don't know what my bitch rejected me. Hurry up. If I'm at a bar and I approach the bitch and start telling me that the bitch reject me like in 30 seconds, I'm buying that bitch a drink. Look, bitch, I'm so glad you saved me all that time talking to you. Thank you. Here, have that drink. I'm gone. <laughs> I'm I'm so happy to get rejected. Shit. I only pay attention when I get accepted. Now, that may be one out of every 900 attempts. Who gives a fuck? Who's keeping count? I might have had three, four thousand bitches, but I was all rejected at least a hundred thousand times. <laughs> Shit. And, and you got that many times, at least you put in your mind you got that many times to get rejected. So what I'm saying is, hurry the fuck up and reject me, bitch. The quicker I get to 100,000, the quicker I'm going to catch that bitch. <laughs> That's like every pimp thing. Every pimp I know. Think like, 
bitch, did you have to take two minutes to tell me you didn't want to do no hauling? Damn! Nigga, waste 90 seconds. Because Pimp got it down where he interviewed a bitch in three minutes, four minutes. No, I'm talking about to the extent he know if he's fuck with her. Shit, man, I'm not finna ride your motherfucking ass around and be talking to you for three, four hours wondering, can I have you, you skank ass motherfucker? Shit. Bitch, if you don't see you wanna fuck with me in under five minutes, you too slow to fuck with me anyway. I'm leaving. <laughs> <laughs> By Rose, but that's right, Elite Carl. I started to say this earlier when I told you you'd be saying some crazy shit. You sound like you got my shit. I started to say that, but I didn't want to say it because I was going to say you said some crazy shit. But you sound like you do. Uh, words unlock no doors in any case. Okay, goddamn it. Thanks for the advice, Pepper. Uh, answer the question. I'm definitely unsure because I know my conversation. <laughs> Rose, but I'm not planting seeds with my words. Hell, hey, if you're not planting seeds with your words, then you wasting your conversation and your time. Because what I'm saying is the, the art of conversation is being able to put thoughts in the person you talk to mind without them realize you're influencing it. You're only talking about what you're talking about. Yeah, baby, you know, I'm the kind of motherfucker when I roll, you know, I try to roll 100. Otherwise, and then you explain what that is, blah, blah, blah. Now, the seeds that's being planted is that I'm first class as far as top notch. So if you want to fuck with me, you want to fuck with something like that. Now, I ain't going to tell if it's all that shit. But now when she go home, let's say she liked me. All she going to think about is the shit that I planned in her head. So when the motherfucking bitch call me, I ain't going to be asking her about none of that shit. So she sure going to be reflecting everything she thought about that shit in her conversation. And I'm going to be able to hear it. And I ain't going to say, oh, girl, you was listening to what I said. I'm going to know she talking about what the fuck I, I said, and I'm going to pounce on it by bringing some more shit to her in the same vein. Man, I got so much goddamn game of this get dizzy fucking with me. Uh, <laughs> uh, Elite 360. Uh, I'm very unsure f when fucking with a bitch that you really like. You know why? Because you only fuck with three or four bitches a month. Man, I fuck with. When I'm out in the goddamn streets, I fuck with three or four bitches every 10 minutes. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> every 15 minutes at the longest. God damn. You can't fuck with three bitches in 15 minutes? Damn. Motherfucker fucked up. So otherwise, when the person that asked about rejection earlier, that's why you want to get rejected a whole bunch of times. So you, you won't be tripping on the bitch you like. Because what I'm saying is this. I teach at SWU. Motherfucker, the only way you're going to get over is talking to a real fine bitch is to be able to talk to a real ugly bitch. Talk to some bitches you ain't interested in and get at them for real. Shit. <laughs> It'll become easy. And with the particular assignments that I give, I show you how easy it is, but only if you do the assignment. Because I can tell you how easy it is, like I do you guys. And you guys don't do shit because I ain't told you shit. You need to learn. Chester Trump, only time I'm confident is when I have on my. Linen two piece since Stacy. <laughs> hey, hey, bro, clothes don't make the man. The man make the clothes. I'm comfortable as fuck in whatever I got on. You know why? Because what I got on is my skin. Anything else is just on my skin. What I'm saying is I'm comfortable in my fucking skin. 
clothes don't make me comfortable at all. Matter of fact, I don't even wear that shit. I, <laughs> if you seen the shit I got, I don't wear that goddamn shit. I don't wear my jewelry. I, I don't wear none of that fucking shit. That shit don't mean shit. Bro. Uh, yes, I'm unsure in many areas of, of my life. Just being honest, OG. That's the only way you're going to get get sure, bro. Just being honest. Uh, BH, I mean, BMH3 TV. That's the only way you're going to get sure, bro. I teach in my goddamn course. Especially in my school. That's why it takes me a month, the first month of every semester to get going. Because I got to make motherfuckers understand the power of being honest with yourself. The power you get and how much freer your mind is to think about what you need to really think about. See, you put so much time and effort in lying and hiding that you ain't got time to be real. That's just what I think. Sterling Gray, Alpha, what's up? I don't know, man. Ramon Bills, I'm about the first part of the course, but I think I'm a little past being honest with myself. <laughs> okay. Can you catch a bitch? Do you know what to say to a bitch? <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> Tevin Green, she depends on what I'm looking for out the woman. That's my problem when I don't just want pussy. You shouldn't just want pussy, motherfucker. You should always want something from a bitch. The bitch wants something from you. Why can't you want something from her? The bitch, she want more than your dick, motherfucker, and you know it. You're going to buy that bitch some shit. Why can't you want more than her pussy? Boy, you guys are slow. Unsure about the lockdown. If you're talking about this uh, virus shit, stay your ass locked down. Rose, where's Rosebud's website? I already gave you that shit. This, this is some repeating shits. Look like. Hey, you know what, man? I'm gonna fucking because I've been on here down there 50 minutes, man. See this, this pen shit, man. That's why I don't like it. Get this shit, man. There's too much going on with it. So let me listen. I told you earlier that anybody could just sit down and listen to me, man. You know, anybody, but just anybody can't take what I say. And I want you to be able to utilize what I say. I want you to actually try it. Fuck, go try it. Try some of this shit I'm saying. My whole thing is being prepared. You got to be prepared to man up for one thing. And then you got to be prepared for what's required for what you're seeking to learn. What I'm saying, bro, if you want to learn this shit, then you got to be prepared to go learn it because you can't learn it sitting, listening, and, and thinking you understand. The only way you learn what I'm talking about is taking your ass out and doing it. That's the only way you're going to learn. Now, what do you think of this video now? <laughs> what, do you, what do you think of this video half of you now? <laughs> do you have any hoes? Or do you have any women? Oh, just like the word pimp, you can substitute the word man. Hoes, you can substitute the word woman. Do you have any women? Or are you thinking about, you know, Getting any? You, you know, same thing. You, do you have any hoes? Or are you thinking about getting some hoes? Thinking about turning out? I'm just saying, you guys, just, all you got to do is motherfucking hear me. You know, I ain't in the habit of wasting my time. Therefore, I got to have some kind of indication, which I think, to be honest, I think this is the best you guys have done on the chat. You at least talking about what the fuck I'm talking about. You at least making me think I'm reaching you. Even though I might not be, I don't really care because, you know, what the fuck? I ain't, it ain't my life, it's your life. So, what I'm saying is, I take my time 
you know, I ain't complaining. I, it's my time. I do what I want to do with it. I take my time to spend with you motherfuckers. And I could be doing something constructive in another area of my life. But I think this is the most constructive thing for me to do. Because it, I don't know, I like doing it. I'm trying to help you motherfuckers be constructive for yourself. And at the same motherfucking time, I'm trying to give you some goddamn game. Free. Do any of you motherfuckers know why you seeking this knowledge? Do, do you know why? <laughs> You're seeking information that requires you to be bold. You seeking information that requires you to be proactive. So sitting around listening to a damn video ain't going to really <laughs> do you no good, man. So have you been actively trying to catch a woman willing to do what you want to do in your life? I don't know. How the fuck do you expect to be able to appear to a fresh woman? How do you expect to be able to show her that you're strong enough to get her to be your woman? <laughs> How do you expect to show her anything if you can't talk to me? On the computer. He got to be talking to the bitch in, in person. I ain't going to ask you nothing that you ain't qualified to answer. <laughs> but I do know that very few of you motherfuckers are qualified to answer any question I have. So I make sure my questions are answerable. That's why I ask you the questions I ask you. And I expect you to have them that's to answer the motherfuckers. Because I didn't water them down already. The uh, uh, down and dirty videos that I do, uh, which are what these motherfuckers are, is really about you know, not about but directed to pimps. You know, uh, we all know pimps get their money from hoes, but how many of you know that money ain't the main priority of a pimp? <laughs> do you? Have any idea what the main focus for a pimp is? That's some kind of shit. Seem like I would want to know that kind of goddamn shit if I was looking for some game. I would want to know what a real man do. How do a real man act? How do he carry himself in this or that situation if I was trying to be an alpha man? What would you say if I said that uh, that the hoes uh, are not a pimp's focus either? See, seems to me you would want to know what the, a pimp's focus is. What the fuck do you think? A dude that know he's lacking, but he want to be a real alpha man. What do you think his focus should be? See, this is not a game. <laughs> and I don't want a motherfucker be responsible for pushing soft dudes into such a hard profession. This is either life or motherfucking death. There ain't no goddamn in between. And if you're afraid to ask questions, if you're afraid to be you, you ain't finna be no man. You finna be uh, whatever, but you ain't finna be a man. Well, you might be a man, but you ain't gonna be no alpha man. If you, you know, green to the game as you motherfuckers really are, <laughs> you, you gotta ask yourself these questions. You got to ask yourself this shit to see if you really want to do this shit. Especially if you're talking about being a pimp. Come on, man. What should a motherfucker focus on? Now, I ain't going to even look at your answers because I believe from checking your motherfucking comments that you motherfuckers would really answer the shit. So I ain't checking in that. There's going to be many of you motherfuckers that's really qualified to, and you, you will be willing to sacrifice 
your time is some, and at some point you're going to be willing to sacrifice your goddamn hard earned money. And when you do, you're going to be able to do exactly what's required to get to the heights of this goddamn field you're trying to get in that I'm in. I ain't trying to need nothing. You know, the only thing I need is ears that can actually hear and a mind that can actually manipulate shit on the fly. If you can do that shit, fuck with me. Look, I'm gone. Hey, I like this doggone video. You see, I like talking pimp shit. I do. But I, I refrain from it. I don't know. I might get into it. You know, when you see me say uh, a down and dirty, matter of fact, nah, when, if you see me, I'm always say if it's a down and dirty video. And if it is, I'm going to be talking about this shit. I'm gone. The fuck is up with this? <laughs> All right, now I'm gone. <laughs> All right.